Behold, the automated teller machine, or ATM. But where did it come from? Meet John Shepherd Barron, born in India in 1925. Although John was born in India, his parents were Scottish. His father was an engineer and his mother was an Olympic tennis player. He eventually found his way back to Europe, studying at Trinity College and fighting in World War II. By the 1950s, John was working for a printing company that produced banknotes. He usually stopped by the bank on Saturdays to cash checks, but one weekend he was running late and arrived at the bank one minute after they closed. John was irritated by the inconvenience. Why couldn't he withdraw cash whenever he wanted? He thought of the vending machines that produce chocolate on demand, and that's when his stuff of genius struck. Mm. He would build an automated banking system. He met the manager of Barclays Bank, and over a pink gin, persuaded the manager to commission several of these machines. Today we call these devices ATMs, or automated teller machines. In 1967, John became the first inventor to create the version that caught on with the public. Here's how this machine worked. When customers wanted to take cash from their account, they inserted chemically coded checks and entered a personal identification number, or PIN. Originally he wanted the PIN to be six digits, but his wife Caroline told him that was too long, and as a result, four-digit PIN numbers have become the world standard. Today, there are more than 1.7 million ATMs across the planet. Behold, the stuff of genius. But where did it go? Perhaps you've noticed the stuff of genius is now on TestTube, the new discovery digital network exploring science, curiosity, and all things awesome. Visit TestTube.com to explore all of our awe-inspiring shows. And if you want, join Stuff of Genius on Facebook, Twitter, and Google+.